Hey everyone, I'm doing a video, it's going to be a series I hope, that on uh, rescaping this guy. And this is really my junk tank. This is um, kind of where all the bits and pieces is I've redone my other tanks and rescaped and, and uh, gotten new fish. This is where the remnants have ended up. And um, so, you know, you'll see some fungulus in there. You've got some uh, gambusia and uh, rosy minnows from a fountain that sprung a leak outside. Um, and uh, so I really need to redo this thing. I'm not sure exactly where I'm going to move all the fish. The fungulus I'll move into a different tank. They'll be fine. The, it's really the uh, gambusia and the um, rosies. I just don't know uh, where to put them. I don't really want to mix them with some of my other fish. So... I'm in a little quandary there, but initially when I set this up, I was kind of doing a Florida biope. I, I um, just wanted a, a swamp, kind of an Everglades look, and it just had the fungulus in there, um, some lined fungulus and the, and the uh, black stripes there, and um, it just had a big stand of water lettuce, um, and then some, uh, the eco-complete, and then um, magnolia leaves that I had put across the bottom, and it looked great. I mean, um, had a nice tan look. Um, real swampy. The challenge was is that as the water lettuce grew, um, it really slowed down the current and what the little sponge filter was able to put out. And I got a bad case of blue-green algae. In fact, if you've had blue-green algae in water lettuce, you know it gets into the crown of the plant. It cuts the underside. Um, all the all the leaves are, and you know, they're kind of close together. You'll just get this thick film across the entire planting. It was really disgusting. The tank reeked, um, looked foul. So I ripped out most of them, had to just junk them. And uh, what I kept, I put into a big bat, um, bath of um, water and hydrogen peroxide. And um, you can see the result. It basically cooked them. It did the job, but all the roots fell off. All the, the leaves have been falling off. And um, I've cleaned this a number of times. It was just um, a massacre on the water lettuce. What is left, I think, will come back. I see the crown is kind of greening up. Everything looks good, but um, the damage is done. So I need to redo this tank. And I think what I'll do is um, I'd like to kind of go back to um, water lettuce. I'd like to play around with it still inside, see if I can make it work. But one thing I did pick up is I got this guy. As I got the high door, the, the 240 gallons per hour um, pump, and we'll see if I set it up on one end of the of the tank and kind of shoot it across long ways, um, w what that looks like, and and um, we'll see where it goes. I do kind of want to make it a little bit easier to clean. There's things I, I like about the Eco Complete and things that I really don't. So, anyways, we'll see where this goes. We'll give an update on um, as I progress in rescaping this. I've got some ideas that I'd like to do, but um, we'll see how it goes. All right, folks. Thanks. Bye.